Good morning guys, so you guys saw me get out of bed and the first thing I do is put on my slides and head to the bathroom because usually I really have to tinkle right when I get out of bed. So after I do my business in the bathroom, I come back to make my bed, but first I want to let you guys know that I actually made a morning playlist for you guys. I actually play this almost every morning and it's in my description, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, so of course now I'm making my bed while listening to that playlist and um, honestly making my bed is just a great time in the morning for me because I know that you know it's helping me start off my day and I know that if nothing else is going right in that day that at least I can come home to a made up bed and that makes a world of a difference for me personally so of course I am dancing I always am just doing random dances then I change into my robe as you can see and I'm off to get ready to take my shower so classic college student of me, I have to wear shower shoes because I'm not about to be barefoot in a shower that is not mine personally. Um, so now I'm just showing you guys how I prepare my hair, I guess, for the shower. I did not have a shower cap at this time. So what I do is I just put my do-rag over my twist that I did and then I take this grocery little bag. I know it's kind of ratch, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do and it's been working for me. So I just take that and then you'll see a little bit later in a couple seconds actually that I take a hair tie and I tie it and that's how I do my thing in the shower. Also very college student of me, I have to use a shower caddy when going into the bathroom. <laughs> this is just how I have to live right now, guys. It'll be over soon. <laughs> um, hashtag senior year. But yeah, I'm just in the um, bathroom now. It's not cute. I know. Don't judge. I am in a dorm room, as I've said. And yeah, I just brush my teeth and wash my face before I get into the shower. <laughs> Okay, so clearly I'm in the shower taking a shower and um, it got a little steamy as you can see so if you want to see what I use in the shower go click on my shower routine I'll put it up in the corner now so I am done taking my shower and here we are at what I like to call my little beauty corner or beauty station where I have all my skincare over nigh on the mic again um so lucky for you guys you guys are gonna kind of get an in-depth look at what my morning skincare routine is because that's just the way the cookie crumbled and this is what my morning looks like so i start off with this pixie toner and while that is drying off y'all will see that i take my ollie multivitamins there they are they're so 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 good you guys they taste so good and that's why i'm doing a happy dance because they taste absolutely amazing so yeah <laughs> So along with my multivitamins, I also take a vitamin D and vitamin K vitamin, and I usually take a vitamin C gummy, but I ran out this morning, so I didn't have it, and I'm just a literal joke. Like, I cannot get through my mornings without lip syncing and dancing. Is anyone else like that, or am I just a weirdo? <laughs> um, let me know in the comments. Um, here I am putting on my vitamin E under eye moisturizer from the body shop 
Y'all know how I feel about them. If you watch my nighttime skincare routine, I absolutely love them. Next, I'm putting on this Honest Moisturizer with Hyaluronic Acid. I recently started using this and absolutely love it. I use it at night and in the morning, but it's just a really good moisturizer for my skin and it's thick enough that it actually moisturizes my dry skin, but I feel like people with oily skin can use it as well because it kind of thins out, but in the best way possible. Um, and then I go in with this Olay Whipped Regenerous Moisturizer. It has SPF 25, I believe, and y'all... For this specific purpose, I packed it on this morning. As you can see, I literally put so many thick dots because I wanted you to see that this is black girl friendly and it looks white now, but when I tell you the transformation is crazy, I'ma just, just wait, just wait. You're gonna see in like literally two seconds. Boom, I told y'all. Literally, what is there's no white cast, there's no nothing, baby. Her skin is clear and moisturized. Okay, so now we finna moisturize the rest of my body along with you know the rest of my body. <laughs> and so I just take my towel and my robe off, and yeah, I'm just moisturizing with the set of a moisturizer. So I decided to go with this all black look, just sweatpants and a long sleeve black shirt. I was just lounging around this day, it was a Sunday. So yeah, I love all black, clearly I'm excited about it. <laughs> um, now I'm about to fix my hair because I can have it looking like this all day. I'm taking this uh, gold Pantene series uh, spray and I'm spraying it all over my hair. And then you guys will see in a second that I'm gonna go in with the hair growth oil that I use. I'll link all of it down below. Of course, I gotta break out in a little dance. That's just, at this point, you guys already know that's who I am and that's what I do. So <laughs> here I am just putting the oil in my scalp. The key to this look is really using bobby pins. I just pinned up the four twists that I did in the back and then I pinned up the ones that I did in the front to the side in the back. Uh, you guys will see what it looks like when I finish, but I feel like this is um, a good style to do if you're out, you know, going to run errands and you don't want to look super crazy. Obviously, I would prefer to, you know, have it all glammed up and like have the twist out, but this is good to just um, use as a protective style, you know, as your hair is resting to transition to the next style that you want it to be in. <laughs> done now you guys can see how it is looking i feel like it came out pretty cute you know i would go to run to cvs with this style and not be embarrassed so there you have it there's my little you know my little updo style or whatever yes ma'am <laughs> So now we are transitioning to the kitchen. Of course, we have to cook breakfast. Cooking breakfast is honestly one of my favorite times of the day because I get to cook something that's super easy and that is honestly nutritious for me. So today, as you can see, I made some oatmeal and then I also had some boiled eggs that I had put in the pot. And I'm gonna show you guys how I do my oatmeal because I don't just put like sugar in there, I go in. 
Um, so I put these are hemp seeds that I put in and then I go into flaxseed ground flaxseed So I feel very healthy preparing this then of course since it's fall I have to go in with my cinnamon and I recently added pumpkin spice to the you know array of things that I put in and it's a game changer it's really really good and then of course I add my chia seeds and I just add a little bit of brown sugar when I'm eating it then I go in of course I had to have chai tea because it's very fall it gives me spice and everything nice and it goes well with my oatmeal and I mix some matcha in there which might seem really weird but it's actually really good with a little bit of honey so that is my breakfast yum 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 i recently started taking ginger shots y'all and let me tell you it just spices up my life that's all i'll say and it makes me feel good but it's spicy baby it's real spicy like for real as you can see from my face <laughs> So recently this has just become my, one of my favorite times of day. I sit here, I eat, and I'm just present, enjoying the sunlight, and thanking God for my day. Today I was watching a sermon because it was Sunday, but usually I do quiet time. And yeah, so that is my morning. I will see you guys next time. I love you guys. Bye!